hello friend welcome back in your previous video i have discussed about that designation i hope you will understand about it how can add the designation in laravel 8 project so now in this video i want to discuss about this user and here you can see friend it's now showing as a user one user one and for the everyone because of all here i have created all that category without this user so that is the user by default this id as a one right so now i want to do i want to visible that name like if you go to our table that means there is a user table and into the user table here you can see there is an id that is a one id so that is our i right now i'm logging with the admin and for this admin actually id one right and also if you go to our um, database again and into the database if you go to that our categories and into the categories here i have already declared one of the table as a user id right that is one of the table field as a user id so now i want to do i want to join two of this table i want to join our categories table to our this users table and then i want to match with our two of this field that means this user id will be matched with our this category user that is the user table this id okay when it should be matched then i want to do i want to get this name so here you can do that work with both of this way you can do that work with a look into rm and also you can do this work with using that query builder so i will share both of this with you then everything will be very clear to you so friend as i told you when you're working with this look into rm then we have to do we have to work with the model right like if you go to our project so right now better i remove everything okay i remove everything then it should be better i remove everything and i just make it clean so right now if you go to our view that means that is the position i actually declared in our view that means if you go to our that is a route route will be needed and then that is our another file uh, that is our layouts that is our profile and into the view area into the category here i have created one of the index.html right and into the index.html here you can see friend i only display with this category as a user id field that means right now this user id field is visible right that is our user id one and for the reasons all that one id is visible so now i want to do i want to join two of this table i want to join our this category table to our user so if you want to do that work with using that eloquent warm then we have to do we have to work in our model that means i have also created one of the model if you go to our model and you can see that is a category model so into the category model here we have to do we have to create one of the function okay so i show you like here uh, after this okay after this i want to do i want to create one of the function and i just name that function as a public public and then function and then public function and i name it as a user so whatever you want so right now i name that method will be as a user method and after that here i want to do i want to create that relation so if you want to create that relation it should be it was a one-to-one -one relation so i want to do and to make this as a return and return and this return this and after that here i want to do i want to add that one-to-one -one relation one-to-one -one relation means it will be as a has one okay that means that will be has one i name it as a has and then one okay friend and has one relation i want to do and that means there has one of the relation with our user so that is our user uh, model and here i want to do i want to add the class so that will be our class and after that which field uh, which both two of this field you want to create that relation i want to create that relation in our user table into the user table that is actually id so this id will be matched with our this categories table this user id right so here you have to do you have to add both of this so i add that id so one will be as a id and here it will be create the relation with our another one another one will be as a user underscore id right friends so i uh, simply added both of these our table field as the id and then user id and also i get all the data i get all the data and display that things uh, in our with the controller right so now open our controller so I have already created one of the controller as a category controller and into the category controller here you can see that is the our eloquent warm and that is our another one so that is our um, uh, query builder right so right now I want to do and to first of all work with the eloquent warm for the reasons here in our database that means this model will be needed so right now I want to do I want to actually um, make it as a comment out 
so that will that is actually our query builder so now i want to do i want to open our this eloquent warm right so with this eloquent warm i will pass this data there is a categories the categories model so from the category model there is a latest all the data and that is our designation which i have already discussed about that things with your friend so right now i get all the data from our categories and here i take the things with this variable and after that i compact it that means here i pass the data in our index.html page right so that is our index.html like if you go to um, that is our view and there's a category and that is our index.html right so here i simply get all the data and visible it on here so now if you want to visible it so you can actually visible it with using that user so here i have created that method name our method name as a user so now with this user we can actually access our this id field that means this user user table field so now i want to do i want to use that user so here we don't need this i want to do i want to use that user and with this user i want to do i want to access our field name that means I want to do i want to display our this name okay that means this name so now i want to do i want to add this our field name our field name will be as a name perfect so that's all you have to do now let's check this out now if you click as a save all i click as a save all and now if you go your side and now if you refresh it yes you can see friend now it's perfectly updated so that is the all that user that means this kazi is visible right if you go to our user and into the user here you can see there is id1 is the, our kazi okay and id2 is for the aryan so if you go to our categories and here if you want to change it like i change it and make this as a two now click as a surf and now you can see that is id2 so now it should be visible for our man's item that should be visible as a two right so now let's check this out if you now click as a that means that is actually our man's fashion and now if you click as a refresh yes you can see that is actually a man's item so man's item is now become changed and now it's become showing as a aryan okay friend i hope it's very much clear to you if you go to that our second page and to the second page here you can see everything is now perfectly displayed so here i create create one of the relation as a one-to-one -one relation with our categories table to our user table and here i match two of this field as the id will be matched with our this categories table user id and when it should be matched i get this name okay that means this table user table name so here if you working with this you look into rm then you can actually work with this you, you have then you have to work into the model area that means in your category model here i have created one of the method and then i return and with this has one and i simply loaded two of this field okay so that's how you can actually create that relation both of this table and you can get this data and here i visible it with our user and then our field name i hope it's very much clear to your friend so in our next video i want to do the same thing say so i want to do the same things with using uh, our query builder so here i have used that eloquent rm so how can do the same that means how can create that relationship with two of this table with using that query builder in our next video i will show you that things with a live example so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video